Hey ya, it's Whimsy and we're back today with another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. I am finally recovering from my cold. I am feeling so much better, back with my energy, ready to play my current favorite game. So yeah, let's jump into it. Okay, so I have a couple of things to tell you guys. I did some things off camera after the stream because during the stream we actually didn't do much, honestly. <laughs> I just went around and we had a lot of fun, but I didn't really advance on any of the side quests. But I decided to search for the demiguys in Hogwarts off camera but by doing that I obviously found other things of course as it's bound to happen I found the muggle studies class which is really cool there was like a cannon and like some kind of paddle boards I guess it's for cricket or something like that I don't really know that sport but I think it was for that in that class so it was pretty cool I found alchemy which is like an advanced optional class you can take in Hogwarts oh yeah I found the deposo puzzle room number two I'm gonna do that on stream though I'm streaming Hogwarts Legacy in two days from now so yeah I'm gonna do that then I'm not gonna do it on on uh, this video because a lot of you guys told me that you actually really appreciated seeing an unedited part of the deposo room uh puzzle room because uh, you guys told me that mostly on youtube what you find is like edited parts of it because it's quite difficult and you know you you can spend a lot of time and you guys said that you were really enjoying the struggle and the unedited part of the puzzle room number one that we did so i'm gonna keep number two for stream and we're gonna struggle together but yeah i discovered that so i saw the sphinx as well really cool and then at that place i got a glitch i think it was a glitch i literally fell through the floor i i gasped i was like <gasps> what just happened but i was able to record after because you can do that with the playstation you can like record part of your gameplay that just happened so i recorded the last five minutes and i caught that glitch on gameplay, so I'm gonna show you. <sighs> but basically, I yeah, I fell through the floor and I discovered a like a werewolf room. And it's behind a tapestry. I would have never known. <laughs> like if I had not gotten that glitch. <laughs> I don't know how I would have discovered that room. But we did. So I did that. Apart from that I made a list. So I don't forget anything that I discovered. I now have Alohomora 2. I found enough demiguys to do that. I found a Bogart closet. Which was super cool. A really nice easter egg or like... Um, detail. I also, I think I found the headmaster office, which is very cool. I could show you guys. It's really awesome. I am like 99.9% .9 sure it's the headmaster's office. Apart from that, I saw Hecate uh, quarters and also Professor Bin's uh, quarters. And that's pretty much it, I think, that I did. So, a couple of things happen off camera, but it's nothing too major. I could show you guys now. I am, I'm, I'm, I'm a hundred percent sure it's the headmaster's office. Like, I don't know why I'm saying, because the headmaster's office is always here in the, uh, the lore. And then I found, wait, oh, there we go. So I used my Alohomora to continue through the uh, trophy because this place was closed before. Uh, wait a minute. Uh, this one. So I used Alohomora. 
And I was like, wait, I haven't found the Handmaster's office yet. I wonder if this leads to it because I checked the map and I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It must be, must be, you know? And then, this is really cool, by the way. I really, really like this corridor. I think it looks super cool. Um, but then after that, I arrived here. I can't go here. That's uh, level three, unfortunately, but it's okay. Let me show you. It is so cool. I cannot. Look at these. First of all, yes. Tease Testral and then, yeah. Anyway. This one. Oh, I didn't take Rebellion. the field page. <laughs> this. This. Dude. That is so cool, though. Usually it's a gargoyle. In the movies, it's like a hippo, a, a phoenix, or a hippogriff. It's a phoenix, I think, in the movies, um, the statue. But basically, you say the password like uh, lemon sherbet or something sherbet lemon. I don't know how you see in a, in English. That's the Dumbledore's one. It it can change depending on the headmaster. Um, right now it's headmaster black, so I'm guessing it's it's something different. But. Uh, <laughs> You say that, and then the statue turns, and then it becomes stairs, and you can go to the headmaster's office, so... It's very cool. Yeah. Yeah. Staircase that leads to the headmaster's office is guarded by an enchanted gargoyle that will let only those who know the password enter. Though anyone choosing to visit the current occupant of the office is difficult to fathom. <laughs> the shade on, on Professor Black, I mean, Headmaster Black, I'm sorry. Oh, that's so cool. There's it. It's probably in his office. I'm, I'm gonna go in his office before the end of the game. Also, I don't know what's up with this. I don't know. But there's something behind. Anyway, so. The plan for today. Is. I really want to go see what it's go was going on with Sebastian and Ominous because they are arguing in a great hall and they are my besties okay so I really wanna and and when I was streaming you guys told me that I should really keep that quest for a video and not stream it because I thought it would be a, like a secondary quest but turns out maybe it's not so I really want to do that first And then we'll see. I think maybe if we have the time, we can do Natty, Natty's quest as well. And I still need to. Oh goodness! Oh, <gasps> they decorated. Oh goodness! Okay, it's good food. I I thought I thought it looked a little um, unclean, but no, it's it's ready to eat, eh? <gasps> Why is there nobody? Rebellion. Oh my god, that's so cute with the bats and everything. Are you kidding? Double, double, double in trouble. Fire burning, golden bubble. Anything to do with the dark heart should be avoided. It's too risky. Anything to do with Salazar Slytherin is worth the risk. I can't agree. And I'll not say a word more. I'm sorry. I won't give up. Okay. So I'm gonna help Sebastian. What were you and Ominous speaking about? He's been ridiculous. Apparently Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here in Hogwarts. Scriptorium. Ominous swears it was used for the Dark Arts, so he wants nothing to do with it. I reminded him that Anne needs a cure. This scriptorium could hold the answers we need. Ominous is right. Meddling in the dark arts is dangerous. There's more to dark magic than people realize. The Gaunts know this better than most. Perhaps I've spoken out of turn. Ominous's family history is personal to him. You don't have to tell me. I, understand. I, I already know anyway. You needn't tell me if you don't want to. If I were you, I'd be begging for more details. Yeah, but I... 
you know, it's I already know. It's not that I'm not interested. <laughs> and you can certainly trust me if you want to tell me anything. Ominous learned dark magic from his parents. Yeah. Yeah, they, they love the to use Crucio on muggles. They love Crucio, that shit. Correct? The Cruciatus Curse, also known as the Torture Curse, inflicts excruciating pain on the victim. Apparently, his parents and older siblings had no qualms about casting us on muggles for sport. It's so lore accurate. Ominous described the sound of the victim's cries as horrific. Mm. So the first time he was asked to cast it himself as a child, he couldn't bring himself to do it. Mm. As punishment, his family cast it on him. The anguish was so bad that when asked to cast it again, he relented. I have repeatedly assured Ominous that he did what he had to, but he still hasn't forgiven himself. Jesus Christ. How horrible. Poor a Ominous, child. he was only a child. He shouldn't blame himself. After that incident, the rift between Ominous and his family only grew. Obviously. That is until I came along. Every moment he isn't at Hogwarts, he's with us in Feldcroft. Ominous trusts me. And more often than not, he winds up listening to me. I'll remind him of that when I follow up about the scriptorium. Watch for my owl. I'll have news soon enough. I'll make Ominous understand. He'll change his mind. Jesus Christ. That's so heavy. It's so lore accurate though. But like, what if I follow him? Like, where do you go? At night. Prepare. Crazy. I was just watching uh, Deadly Hallows Part 2. And look at these. I just wonder if there are more elsewhere. Uh, there he is. Yeah, here. Okay, and then outside maybe? Because in the movie... In the movie, um... McGonagall does Piertotum Locomotor and she asks the statues to defend the school and they just fall from the ceiling and from the walls. It's such an epic <laughs> part of the movie. It is really cool. In a, it's in Deathly Hallows uh, part two, but um, I think it's it's like it's them. Like that's why they put them there. I'm pretty sure. Like. Revelio. The Easter eggs and the detail of this game is just unmatched for me. It's unmatched. It's so cool. Well, I guess we're uh... okay. I guess we uh, we just like started putting things in place for a future quest. Like didn't really start it, but we'll see where it leads us later. But right now we need to do other stuff before. So I need to use the three combat plans and I need to use a dip also on a levitated enemy. So maybe I could do that as I meet Natty uh, for the assignments and stuff. Cause I'm pretty late in my assignments, let's be honest. Let's have a raid here. Um, not apparate, use flu powder. Every time I say apparate. I'm most pleased to be but it's not that. Good lord. Oh, this looks cool. Hmm. <laughs> Wait. 
What is it? Revelia. Wait, what? Incendio. Defender. Leviosa. Accio. Confringo. I don't know. Strange. Okay. Oh, there's a beast. Then. Giant purple toad. Let me change this. I think it can give me um I didn't show you guys. I wanted to show you guys my gear. I'm not going to. <laughs> I wanted to show you my gear because I've upped my game, y'all. I have um, increased damage with ancient magic throw and upgraded. I have increased damage with defendo upgraded. I have increased damage with incendio upgraded. Increased ancient magic meter with meter fill rate upgraded that item as well. Increased damage with Confringo. I upgraded everything basically, plus putting like good things for me. I use Confringo, Defendo a lot, also Incendio too, and then magic throw, of course. Increased damage dealt to curse targets. Now that's the thing, I don't have the curse thingies yet. That's with dark arts, I think. And I don't know if I want that. I kind of want to use it for stupefy. I gotta see. I kind of want to use it for stupefy, but that's it. Does that make sense? Because I don't want to use... I don't know. The unforgivables, I feel like I could use against like trolls or stuff like that like an imperio maybe but i don't want to use like crucio and avada kedavra um i still want to learn them but yeah i'm kind of mm, i don't know i'm doing like a semi good playthrough i guess so i'm gonna i'm gonna try with stupefy because it is kind of like a curse, let's be honest. So we're gonna use this dark hearts and now I can actually have this benefit. Also, I have in my loom, in my room requirements, I have uh, Unforgivable 3. You guys told me that in the comments and I had not noticed so I went back and, and checked my loom. And for that, I think I need the toad. That's why I'm I'm talking about that right now. Um, I think I need the giant toad stuff to do it. So yeah, but basically it would make me like super OP probably. Um. Oh yeah. <laughs> You're too far. But yeah, Settle yourself, you guys told me that it would like make me really fucking strong. So we'll see. If it makes me too strong, then I can of course not use uh, the trait. But I'm interested for sure. Everything's all right now. So if I go now, let's just, well, I should unlock, I should unlock a flu powder first. Uh, that was a Merlin, Merlin trial. Ah, here. This one. Oh, a little cat. Hello. Pet the cat. If someone would come to my aid, what? 
What is going on? Oh! You there? Can you help me? What? What seems to be the problem? You may well ask. I'm convinced I saw a grim. Oh. An omen of death. Really? I'm not safe. But if it can't see me, I'll be all right, won't I? All I need is an invisibility potion. Yes, that's what I need. The grim, if you saw one, is an omen. Omens don't attack you, so I doubt an invisibility potion will do you much good. I can see you don't believe me. Fine. Then my blood will be on your hands. Am I out for, for real? Oh. <sighs> what seems to be the problem? I'm not seeing all I I'm afraid I'm all out of invisibility potion. Safe. Careful. <coughs> yes, that makes sense. And you're sure you don't... No. Very well. Damn. I wish I had one just to know... Would you want to help? What she would do. Well, I can make one, I guess. Or buy. But maybe she won't be there when I come back. That's the thing. Let's let's go to Oh my god. Let's go to the room of requirement. First and foremost. Put the toad. Cause I'm pretty sure that's let, let me let me check first. Uh I could change. This one. So I have this, um, but I need a, a tree, yeah, like this one. Oh no, it's Neasel! Oh, then why did I need a toad for... I actually don't remember. Oh, I needed a toad to upgrade, I think. No? I'm so confused. I t I saw I saw a toad for something but I don't remember what. God damn. Well anyway, okay, I need a neasel. But we have neasels, um can I steal them in the beast class? <laughs> also I changed a couple of things around. Did you guys see that? Look at that. I put a little bit of like a bookcase situation, a new uh, hippogriff statue, new art. I can't pick it up. Revelia. Shit. Destroy. Let me make an invisibility. How long does that... Oh, that's really quick. Okay, cool. Now I have a lot. I should make more of a venomous tentacular. Is what I should do. Venomous... I can't. Must be grown in large pots. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Is it this one? La, la, la. Oh, yeah, it is. There we go. Venomous tentacular. Come on. Come on, come on. I need invisibility to give it to the lady. To the lady. I think also my spell set is okay for now. We might change it back differently, but should be okay. There we go. Ooh, uh, going through the potions. I got, I got a a trophy. Nice. Awesome. Okay. La 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 la. La, 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 la. 
Let's go back here, madam. I have what you need, ma'am. <laughs> I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Oh, she's still here. Okay. What seems to be the Arla? I have some. Well, as it happens, I have what you need. Here. Not sure it'll help you though. Be careful, won't you? Oh, you're a gem, you are. I'll be sure to be very careful. And you be careful too. No Grim is going to get me. Uh -huh. Thanks to you, kind child. I must insist that you no. accept this small token of me gratitude for your thoughtfulness. Me gratitude. Why, thank you. So now I have more of these. Okay. All right. I'm uh I'm ready for some adventure. Ah, uh, we? Oh, like like these dudes. This is almost too Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa, 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 I don't remember how to play. Ah! Never liked vegetables. Never liked vegetables. Feisty little foliage. Good bring them. Miserable weed. Okay, this one. Uh, so close. Apart from that, I needed to do. I needed to do. The pulse on a levitated enemy. Okay. And then. Yes. Nice. <sighs> and it was my dueling feet. How convenient. My dueling feet was what I needed to do for the assignment. <laughs> Love to see it. Oh, yes. Let's Hello. liberate a Nifla. Let's go. La 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 la. Na, 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 I love this game. <laughs> well, not this mini game. This this is not very necessary. You are free. Oh my goodness. No 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 no. Okay. Free falling. <laughs> uh. Give me that. That's how we do. Um, so now I think, I think I've done. Yeah, we can learn the sendo and flipendo. I am so excited when we come back. Cool. I've always said travel broadens the mind. Oh. I'm full, really. God damn it. Cottage. The idyllic. This I idyllic idyllic country cottage belongs to an idyllic squib who chooses to live in a wizarding world rather than try to integrate with muggles like some squibs do. He is content to farm his land non magically and supply local hamlets with fresh fruits and vegetables. Although he will accept the occasional engorgement charm on the gourd or two. Honestly, being a squib. Like, wait, did I just get that for my vivarium? Did I just get this magnificent cottage for my vivarium? Oh my god. You're kidding. That's amazing. Yeah, being a squib, can you imagine? Your parents are magical and everybody expects, expects you to be magical 
and you're not. You have no magic and you can't use it. Like... Mm, like, why? And that's so sad. I could never. Oh my god. Okay, there's a merchant just there. Leopold, I need to sell. Sir. Sir. This is cute. This is so cute. What the hell? I love it. Hello. <laughs> See if there's something you need. I kind of want to buy that. I don't know. Maybe it's cute. La 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 la. <laughs> um. Increase damage dealt. No. Let's get rid of this. No, no. And then slot level two. Level three, I might keep. There we go. That's better. That's been a pleasure. Thank you. Helped me out a lot. This is so quaint. I love it. <sighs> so much money around here too. I'm just here stealing. Unidentified, really? Goddamn. Okay. That's uh, that's a lot. All right. Da -da 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 -da. It's the Niffler. So cute. I know I could have saved it, but maybe just going back in. Oh, in his natural habitat is not too bad. I can't save them all, you know. And is it really saving them when I take them from their home? Like... There we go. Okay. Natty? Hello? Wait, let me go to the cave first. Sorry. Sorry, I just... I need to see... <laughs> Oh, <laughs> I can unlock Hello, it. Nora. Yes, thank God. There we go. Do -do -do -do. Do -do -do. Revelia. That's it. Why was it protected with an Alohomora level 2? Are you kidding me? <laughs> it better be worth selling. This is beautiful, by the way. Who lives here? Psst, over here. Quietly. I'm here. <laughs> I'm glad that you're Run in <laughs> and sprint in. We need to stay low and remain quiet. Natty, what's going on? Why are we all the way out here? As promised, I did some investigating to find out what Harlow is up to. I followed him to the Hog's Head. I noticed him reading a letter. All I could see was that it was signed by and bore the seal of Victor Rookwood. And after you told me that Rookwood and Harlow were after you, I decided that you were the perfect person to join me in taking them down. For good. Where? That letter is the tangible proof that Officer Singer needs. It is why I followed Harlow here, and why I wrote to you. I need your help to retrieve it. Can't we just bypass Officer Singer and go directly to the Ministry? 
Do you think they will listen to a student? Only Officer Singer can start an investigation. Yeah. The Ministry will come in later. I mean, fair you enough. You seem to be very determined in stopping Rookwood and Harlow. Why? I knew men like him in Uganda. I know how bad things can get if they are not stopped. Mm. It's a long story. One I promise to share when we have more time. For now, let's do what we came to do. I'll help you find the letter, Natty. I'm glad to hear it. First, we must access the castle keep. Kay. I'll check the main gate, see if you can find another way in. I do not see any guards, but we should still try to be as quiet as possible. Hollow is here, after all. All right. No trolls. Rebellion. Okay. Yeah. Wait, isn't it? Oh, it's on the, oh, on the other side. Okay, duty. No one enters unless they're with the pack or the ashwinders. Anything you take from a welcome guest gets split. Do not leave until you've been relieved from replacement. I can't use my broom. Pretty sure I can go up here though. Oh. What's that? Interesting. Okay. But yeah, through here. It's kind of interesting how they're called Ash, ash Winders too. The, uh, the bad guys in this... Um... Hmm. I wonder what that does. In this Closer. game. That did it. Okay, and then... What do I do with... Oh, here. Leviosa. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, they're called Ashwinders, just like the animal. But they're kind of like Death Eaters, I guess. Just not called Death Eaters. Rebellion. It's just interesting. I need to find a way into the gatehouse to open the gate for Natty. I'm making a lot of noise. <sighs> Can't I go? No? Okay. There's nobody Dead end. here. Must be another way in. I like this. Easy. That looks as if it might raise the gate. Can't believe I have to write this down, but you moon wines, moon minds, don't listen. Push the gate open. Don't blast it. If I find it blown to pieces again, I swear to be the end of you lot. Can I blast it? <laughs> Would have been cool. Okay. I. Uh-huh. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Risky. Ooh. Okay, Spider-Man. Oh, that's it. I thought I thought I was going places. But no, not really. Oh, I can go down here. Okay. Wait, didn't that work? What the? Why didn't you enter, girl? I I need to do it multiple times. Maybe. 
Oh, I see. Like this. Okay. I will be right up. I knew you could do it. This way. I will get the door. Okay, that's why. Hello, Homora. Hello, Homora. Do the mini game. <laughs> Thought I was dying. That is the main keep. My guess is that we'll find Halo and the letter inside. We'll need to be careful once we get. Are you okay? I hear them. Yeah, restrain the pain. <gasps> is that high wing? High wing. How dare! You know hippogriff. Okay, no, we're saving High Wing for sure. Well. I am kicking you all of your you guys' asses. Agreed? This is our chance. Go! Yes, go, 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 go. Oh my oh. god. Lost it. Oh, there's got to be a, another way to Girl, get out to the Girl, when I tell you to run. Somewhere. Yeah, run. <laughs> G. I hope Natty stays out of trouble. Holy yeah. shit. Why do they have high wing? Uh, they're poachers. The fuckers. Oh my god. Okay. I don't know if that's what I'm supposed to... Yeah. There we go. Now we jump, jump. Woo! Not the safest <laughs> place to sneak into. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Oh, yeah. A vegan veld? <laughs> I have too many. I have 25 now. That didn't do anything to me. What the fuck? <laughs> I like the. Doom. I don't know. I like the that effect. <laughs> For some reason, I appreciate it. Okay. Let's go. Save high wing. I did not expect to see High Wing here today. Let me tell you. Revelia. Going fast. <sighs> I hope Natty's having an easier time of it. Let's do this one. Get to the roof is the main objective right now. Am I gonna leave while flying on high wing? <laughs> Imagine! Like super badass. Oh god. I would love, 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 love that. Okay, I can go there. But I can also go there. Okay. Anyways, to go. Okay, that's totally useless, isn't it? <laughs> I thought maybe, but no. <laughs> that was wishful thinking. You're going home in a wooden box! Let me out, 
to save you from these barbarians. Ah! Let's save you. Let's save you, my babies. Uh, you? There we go. There, there. I mean you no harm. <laughs> Four yubber nose be cautious. Three nasals, clever and meaner than they look. Watch the claws. Will I get them? Five giant purple toad. Always wear gloves when handling. One thestral. No, you lot can see it. Jesus. Two hippogriffs have a lead on where to get a pair. And no phoenixes. Thank God. Okay, there isn't another that I'm not seeing. Okay. Just in case. Wait. Oh, it's a wig and weld. Alright. Revelia. Okay. This one... Uh, no, no, no. Oh, well, that works too. Okay. Ooh, there's a chest. Astrid, keep an eye on my stash, eh? It's yours if I mysteriously disappear. That liar cheated us out of what was ours, so I took what I could and hid it here. Twenty done years and treated no better than fools who've been here. Two blasted weeks, Manfred. Astrid and Manfred. Okay. Revelio. There's nobody in this castle, let's be honest. Like, I haven't seen many of them at all. I'm going up. Let's not forget. Oh! Oh! <gasps> Defendo right. on the fucking. Epic! Oh my god. <gasps> there you are. Bow, bow, bow. Bow. Come on. Bow. Hello, okay. Hurry. Oh my god. Let's go. Oh my god. Oh, that's so cool. What? They're trying to have a cadaver us. Jesus Christ. That was epic. Oh. Wait, how did she get into the other... Express must be returning from an unscheduled run. Where's the Hogwarts Express? I'm sorry, I didn't I didn't see. It's the music. <laughs> oh, it's there. You're kidding. Ooh. Can I pass under? Let's keep that 
little maneuver between us, High Wing. Uh, I'm crying. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Not over the lake. <laughs> I wonder if anyone can see us from the castle. Sorry. <laughs> what the <laughs> How exciting. <laughs> oh, it was exhilarating, wasn't it? I wasn't sure we were going to make it out alive. <laughs> there was no need to worry. I had it all under control. Were you able to find the letter? Summoned it straight out of Harlow's hands. <laughs> I will say, I did not expect to see him cast the killing curse at us. Yeah. He won't forget this. Be on your guard. Of course. What did the letter say? That Rookwood's looking for a phoenix. <laughs> not sure where he will find one. But it also included Harlow's orders to inspect that castle for the poachers. Enough to connect Harlow to the crimes. I shall deliver the letter to Officer Singer. She'll have to do something when she sees it. Now, tell me, where did you meet these hippogriffs? I've only met Highwing before. Poppy introduced us. Poppy Sweeting knows a hippogriff. <laughs> of course she does. Poppy will be relieved to know that Highwing's safe. I came to the right person for help. My mother will be worried. I must go. Seek me out soon. I shall have much to tell you. I can just go around with my... When you have a moment, please stop by the Room of Requirement. Deke tells me he has something to share with you. Time for a jaunt, I'd say. What say we pick up the pace a bit?
little quicker. Faster. Okay, broom who though? I'm never using my broom again. Like... <laughs> no, bro brooms, broom is a little bit more... quick. But like... <laughs> okay. Uh, I knew, you know, I, I knew because I saw... I saw that we could mount it someday, but I just, I, I don't know, I don't know what I expected, but it was not this, like, or maybe I expected it, but it still really hit me, I, I don't know. As a fan of the series, this <laughs> whole <laughs> moment is like, I mean, <laughs> The beginning of the game and this moment, uh, <laughs> they hit hard. <laughs> they really do. Jesus. <laughs> I can't stop crying. Holy shit. Y'all. The detail of the hooves. Oh. Just like in the movie. I wish there was a bit more of a shh, just like in the movie. When we touch the water. In Prisoner of Azkaban. But, I mean, I'm fine with this. This is a, oh, there we go. I, I need the music now, but it's going to get copyrighted if I play it. <sighs> Baby, you're so beautiful. No need to race now, my friend. Slow down now. There we go. 
I can just go around in Hogwarts. High wing, go! With my freaking hippogriff. Master high wing. Nobody reacts. High wing, go! Let's go. Come on, high wing. Faster, high wing. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, high wing. Oh god. <laughs> We're fine. <laughs> Nobody reacts. I uh, this game I don't know how to explain uh what just happened <laughs> I don't know how to explain why I'm so emo emotional um I don't know I don't know how to explain it's uh but I know that if you're a fan of the series you probably understand um I think broom is still faster a little more agile but like flying with a hippogriff though <laughs> it doesn't get much better than this like I fucking wish dude I want to do this in first person, you know? Like, I wish that this game had a mode where you could be a first person camera and just go around and, and do what... I don't know. I, I think it would be really cool too. I was like, oh, it would be cool if we could get away on, on High Wing's back. Like, okay, the game said, yeah, you want that? You want that? You ready? <laughs> and delivered. Holy. The game just keeps on delivering. It's... Perhaps a hybrid. I finished the activities you signed me, Professor Garlic. Wonderful. <sighs> I hope you gained a greater appreciation Broom for who? the floor in our lives. <laughs> I am I'm sorry, I'm forever done. enraptured I'm done. by it. Just yesterday, I spent hours pruning my self-fertilizing shrubs and flutterby bushes. Didn't realize how long I'd been at it until the sun began to set. Well, if there's one thing I love to see more than my plants thriving, it's one of my students doing the same. Now, ready to learn flipendo? Oh yeah. Chin up. Keep a flipendo. light grip. Flipendo. <laughs> it's all in the wrist. Let's see you give it a go. Oh god. You will want to focus with this spell. Nothing is mortifying as knocking back a colleague when all you wanted to do was move a few parts. Oh, yeah, think. I'm I'm going to use it to knock back people, Wonderfully don't worry. Done. If you'd like to practice a bit more, you're welcome to do so here in the greenhouse. Just here. Hands, please. Maybe it's a four spell capable of dispelling violet shields charms. Defender, look at that. You're a natural. Greenhouse won't keep itself in order without a nudge from me. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm not talking. I'm just, I'm. <clears throat> it's, 
it's a lot it's it's a lot to uh process it's not that it's a lot but it i need time i need, <laughs> I need time to really properly process what just happened you know Wait, divination? Is that what I'm... Oh yeah! Oh yeah, let's go to divination. I wanna see, uh... I wanna see Nadia's, uh, mother. Yeah, let's do it. <sighs> Ironically, I didn't see ahead of time how bored I'd be in divination class. <gasps> Hello, Adelaide. Yeah, you your uncle. I saved Very him. Very well, thanks to you. The more I learn about Ranrock's foul lot, the more astounded I am that my uncle survived. I looked back over his old owls and noticed that they included pertinent details about his rare metal deposits. I believe that Ranrock's fiends were after those deposits <sighs> and that they needed my uncle's knowledge. He was willingly going to rot away in that cell to keep me safe. Any other pertinent details about those owls? Plenty. Uncle Roland couldn't be certain, but he thought he overheard goblins talking about infusing something into goblin silver. He wasn't sure what they meant, but something about the way they spoke of it made his skin crawl. Ugh, it's clear you saved my uncle from a very bad lot. Hmm. It was nothing at all, Adelaide. I'm just glad your uncle's safe. So am I. I need to put on my Seeing robes. Jesus Christ, I look like a... I told him that he must a remain vigilant from now on. I, for one, can't help but look over my shoulder now whenever I leave the castle grounds. I need, I need to put my... <laughs> ah. Oh, my real ones. These or... I like these. Yeah. And then we have a couple. Uh, that's a bit weird. That kind of works. Maybe without. Yeah, that's cute. And... Uh, no gloves. Yeah. Oh, God. There we go. We're going to class right now. Okay. Who would have thought someone as young as me could save my uncle's life? There we go. Wait, with cards it's kind of fun though. I think I would have fun in this class, even if it's not... Well... The most... Serious one? Well, it kind of is. Especially with... Uh, centaurs. Um, when Firin's teaches it it's just amazing and it's in a rumor requirement i think too <gasps> not a grim <laughs> now it makes it look cool you know not like trelawney Uncle Roland sends his best. He yeah. often asks after you and his ass. I hope those assignments were challenging enough for you. I've completed all of my tasks, Professor Onai. Very well done. Although I must admit, I did have some. I think it's the same voice that actor you would follow through as Natty. Now, as you have no doubt sharpened your perception by completing my assignment. I'm not sure, but I, I am think curious. Based upon the knowledge that one's present. 
and even one's past may reveal traces of what is to come. What do you see in your own future? Triumph, danger, power. I'm not sure. Triumph. There will be hardship, I'm sure of it. But I see triumph in the end. A measured perception. Very wise. Nothing worthwhile is ever easy. And that is why such futures are worth striving for. But this talk of tomorrow should not divert us from your present success. I shall inform our good deputy headmistress of your exemplary performance. And if that performance is any omen of what your future may hold, then I, for one, see great things. Channel your magic towards your targets. Another, uh, purple. You have it. And a demi guys. Now, why not practice the new spell on the training dummy? Would be kind of cool to have. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry, yeah, I didn't mean. I kind of want to put it. Um, like this. Or, okay, let me see. This, this. Um, and then this, I think would be cool, but it's cool with Olivioso as well. That's the thing. I would like to do Olivioso and then, uh, you know what I mean? It's so hard to choose. Maybe... Um, I'm sorry. Wait. Uh, like this. 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 Let's try it like... But I need... Actually, I'm not gonna do that. Because <laughs> I need this for the beasts. So I should do like this, and then this one, or this, yeah, yeah, I think that's better. Excellent, I think you have it. <laughs> like that's such a cool combo, no? Like this. You must stop preparing and put your newly honed skills to the test outside of the classroom. Yeah, yeah, no, I, I, I know. Let me just pass time and take that demi, guys. <laughs> Mind now, demi guys. You still here? My God. Oh, I could talk to her too. Professor, do you have a moment? I do. I was wondering how you decided to teach divination. Ah, the art of divination is an important yet often misunderstood branch of magic. Those of us who possess the sight are rare. And, as is often the case with the unique among us, we can frequently be misread, even feared. When I was granted the opportunity to teach others about my gift and the good it can do, I was most grateful. I see. Natty told me that you and she moved here from Uganda, where she had attended Wagadu. Yes. Natsai and I both loved Uganda and Wagadu, 
but we are happily settled here now. I had foreseen such a change, but hmm. did not know the details until it occurred. I was glad of the outcome. You would be wise to remember that the consequences of our actions are complex. And so, divining what is to come is not as simple as gazing into a crystal ball mm. or studying the bottom of a teacup. I find it truly intriguing, even if I don't fully understand it. <laughs> intriguing. That is one word for it. And I'm certain you will come to understand many things more deeply in the days ahead. You are a student at Hogwarts, after all. It cannot have escaped you that we in the Wizarding world are forever navigating the seemingly inexplicable. Of course, Professor. Now, I know that we both have places to be. Not because I have the sight, mind you, but because I am a professor mm -hmm. and you are a student. I have enjoyed our conversation. I like talking to the teachers. I should do that with all of them. I've started doing that with all of them. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna stop here. I know, I know it's hard. But we can do it. Um, let me see the quest for next time. Attend astronomy class. That's going to be really cool. Professor Shaw. I, I haven't seen Professor Shaw yet. I have all of these I can do in a stream. I don't know if next time I play will be the stream or if I'll have time to play again tomorrow. Not sure yet, but um, we'll have a lot of uh, things to do. Oh, Deke, Deke wants to speak to me. Okay. Anyway, um, <clears throat> we'll do the Depulso puzzle for sure in uh, in the stream. But yeah, next next main episode with main quest is going to be astronomy class. That's very exciting. But first and foremost, we are going to go back to the Gryffindor common room. And we are going to tuck our friend in bed. Revelia. Tuck our little friend. Because now I have... Um... Wait, let me think. Now I have... Uh... Nighttime clothes. Okay, let me think though, because I think if I go. through here. and then through here. Yeah. I'm trying to uh, do it by heart, but I don't know the whole school yet. I'm getting better, but I don't know the whole school. I really wonder if I can. Rebellion. Incendio. But you never know. I'm trying everything. Maybe there was another way to go to Gryffindor. Gryffindor Tower is what I mean. <clears throat> but this is the way I know how. Uh, but maybe I could check on the map if there would be an easier way. Like a way that is more... Um, oh, here. That is quicker. Stop a moment. Jesus. We're going up. There we go. Here we are. Grata Domo. Oh, students ought to have a strict schedule. No more of this waltzing in and out of the tower at all hours. So we don't have a curfew yet, is what I'm understanding of all this. <coughs> <coughs> all right. An apple. Before bed. Pretty sure that's my 
bed or is it yeah that that's my bed um so let's change <laughs> wait uh none and then wait 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 here these these are perfect yes light nightwear <sighs> love it also i forgot to show you guys uh, I had I didn't do it yet I have the Merlin's cloak but I haven't tried it on yet because I saw that I could claim it and I was like and then I thought okay I will wait for filming that was during my off camera It looks pretty good. And I think it has a bit of an effect. As I can see. Like we can't really see because it's nighttime. But it does look good. Oh very cool. Yeah, it, it like twinkles. Merlin's cloak. Very cool. But right now... We want to go to bed. <laughs> A dashing long coat to go to bed. Kraken. Ooh. This one looks really good. I gotta say. <laughs> okay. Like this. And then... <clears throat> we can wear... bit of a scarf Maybe this one kind of fits I feel like or this one I think I like this one better and then Nothing, but we need, there's, there's one to go to sleep. This one? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, this one is kind of cool. That's so cute! What do you mean? Ah, uh, this one looks a little bit like... Uh, if it was blue, it would look like a little bit like the... Beau Baton. Whimsical nightcap. There we go. That's better. There we go. Now we're ready to go to sleep. Yep. 
Um, stopping here. <laughs> Looking ridiculous. What an amazing, amazing episode. I really loved it. I hope you guys enjoyed too. I'm sorry for crying so much. I couldn't stop. Like, it was... It was really intense emotionally for some reason, but I really enjoyed that and I'm definitely gonna use high wing and the test roll again um, to go around. <sighs> this game keeps on delivering, keeps on giving. Game of the year for me, for sure. <laughs> there is no way that anything beats <laughs> the emotional, but also the fun that I'm having. Uh, emotional attachment and the fun that I'm having with the game. Because I really love the gameplay as well, so... Like, I'm playing Resident Evil 4 Remake right now on Twitch. And I really love the game, but... It's fun and the gameplay's cool, but like... Hogwarts Legacy though, like it's a step above everything for me so far. So yeah, for me, I, I understand it's not going to win Game of the Year, but for me, I think it's going to be my Game of the Year. Like, yeah, that was amazing. I really hope you guys enjoyed as well, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!